fantastic and I'm gonna see what I can paint in 10 minutes versus what I can paint in 10 hours in this awesome painting challenge. We're going to be using acrylic paint and I'm gonna be staying in this art studio for a whole 10 hours, challenge myself to see what I can actually make in 10 minutes versus what I can actually accomplish in a whole 10 hour time frame. So let's get into the 10 minutes versus 10 hour painting challenge. First, I'm starting off with a 10 minute painting and then I'm going to up the challenge and I'm going to start a brand new painting from scratch and this is gonna be a 10 hour painting. So we got 10 minutes on the clock and that's going to start right now. It's just gone unexpectedly quick. completely messed this up with the pressure of time! I have to simplify to most basic details and that's what we're gonna go with here. I did not expect this time to go by so quickly. Minutes in a normal life is like way longer than this. Oh my gosh, two minutes? <sighs> Too late. I'm just gonna have to work with it. Oh my gosh. What am I doing? I'm panicking. What is this? This is so much paint. Ah! Ah, 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 ah. 52 seconds. Oh, wow. It moves in there. Okay, white and fluorescent, let's go. Let's go, we got 30. This is the absolutely worst paintbrush to be using right now. Four, three, two. Hey, I'm gonna be honest, this was very, very stressful and I can't believe how fast 10 minutes went. Like, look at this mess. Look at this artwork. In my mind, 10 minutes is like usually a long time. So now let's see what it's gonna be like for 10 hours. Brand new, right from the start. We're gonna have to gesso it first. We gotta gesso the canvas once that timer starts. So when you're working really quickly and you have a little bit of time as an artist, you gotta make a lot of decisions super, super quickly. However, this is a super good creativity challenge. I don't have time to procrastinate. I'm just gonna have to make a decision, make a mark, and make it happen. I encourage you to dive in in the 10 minute versus 10 hour creativity challenge of making art. Okay, so I'm starting off with a wash. All right, so it has been 50 minutes and I finally got the drawing done, uh, the gesso, base layer, it's finally dry. I got my palette loaded with some paint and I got clean water and now we're ready to paint. Okay, so I got the base layers done. Well, I just got darkest value done. I gotta make the lighter values, but look at the time. Sometimes I get a little bit too crazy with black paint, I'll be honest. I'm working on it. All right, I am at the seven hour and 40 minute mark. All right, so we're building the values. I am getting all those light values in there. Well, I got a really good clear image of my artwork, um, but I noticed that it's mostly the same dark gray. Now I need to really build up that light to make it primarily in the focal, the, in the focal point. Right? Otherwise, it'll all just look like a two-dimensional piece, and I want to create the illusion of form in my art. You can see the clock. I am, well, more than halfway done. Uh, the painting is more than halfway done, but you can see I have no background. All right, so I am working on adding in some darker values again. I'm getting my finer brush strokes. I'm focusing, I got all my, I blocked it on my values. Now I'm really focusing on detail, but before I do my very final details, I gotta make sure I do that background so that way it doesn't look like a sticker on my background, right? I want my, my focal point, my subject of my art to blend into the background, so I gotta make sure I put my background in before I put in those final details.
So there is three hours and 30 minutes left. Art takes time. All right, so I'm gonna pause this for now. I'm gonna do the background. Then I'm gonna come in, paint. I haven't actually painted the, the, the shutter shades yet. That's not actually the color they're gonna be. Tongue, although I do kind of like the vibe that's going. But anyways, I'm gonna probably just reiterate that with this. Um, I have a paint color that I've been super, super excited to use for the shutter shades. I bought it specifically uh, for an instance where I did purple shutter shades on an artwork. I'm on the last two hours. I'm gonna be honest, it definitely feels like I've been painting for eight hours. I'm really tired, so the creative flow is definitely wearing down. I'm definitely getting tired, but we gotta finish because it looks like, it looks like a sticker. Stuck, 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 stuck on. So we gotta make it look not stuck on. Gotta blend it in. So here's the thing about um, finishing an artwork in 10 hours as a challenge. You actually have to finish it. And I can't think about it, I just have to do it. Now, oh my God! We're under the hour. <laughs> okay, time to stand back and check. Whoop. Yep. Yep. Okay, I have 46 minutes left. I gotta get that another coat on the glasses. Five minutes and, well, now 45 minutes. 45 minutes left. Oh yeah, I didn't even put the dark into the glasses again. Like, I was like so not stressed out and then it's like all of a sudden, you're going through this long, long, long middle where you're like, I got all the time in the world. And now there's only 45 minutes left. Twenty-five minutes left, so I was feeling panicked, and then suddenly I only have, I still have twenty-five minutes left, so I'm feeling really good right now. I gotta get some more highlights coming off, but it doesn't look like a sticker anymore. I'll be honest, I thought the ten-minute painting was going to look a lot more like this. I'm at six minutes, so I'm at the point where I, I don't want to get, I don't want to mess anything up because I'm not going to be out of time. I am at four minutes and 20 seconds. At some point during this video, I broke also a nail. <laughs> Fix the nose. Now, you know what I'm thinking about? I'm thinking about burritos. Now I'm just adding nonsense, possibly. Possibly nonsense. Let's just add some colors. Otherwise the world is boring. Okay, we got two minutes and 54 seconds. So let's highlight these cheeks. Okay, okay, okay. Oh yeah, highlight 
the nose again for the hundredth time. One, one minute, 33 seconds. We're gonna add some value. Texture. Man. Oh, 55 seconds. Whoa. This is where this is how I'm messing it up, right? The last spot. Oh yeah, I just oh my gosh, what am I doing? Oh, 30 seconds and I'm making crazy mistakes. Why? Why would I do this to myself? 20 seconds. Yep. I just had to do it, didn't I? I had to go there, mess things up. Oh my! <laughs> We're gonna be okay. It's gonna be fine when it dries. It's so thin. One. That's it. She's done. What?